Hello everyone, this is Lydia. The ability to write text on projects opens up lots of creative possibilities. I love using my Cricut pens to write sentiments on the inside of my cards. In this tutorial, I'll show the basics of creating written text in Design Space. Here's a card that I designed. The front is layered and glued to the card base. The writing will go on the card base. I'll hide the front of the card for now. First click on the text button on the left side of the screen and, and then click the arrow on the font drop down menu in the edit bar. Uncheck only kerned fonts. Next click on filters and check writing to filter the fonts to fonts that, uh, that have a writing style. Cricut fonts are the only fonts with a writing style. So if you know what, you can search for the font you're looking for if you know what font you're looking for. Otherwise, you can scroll down to the one you want. I'm going to select Birthday Bash. I'll enter my text. So as you can see, since this this font has multiple styles, it comes up as a as a cutting font. If I were to go up here and change the operation to pen, I would get an outline or bubble letters, and I don't want that. So I want to change the style to writing. This font also has a writing italic style. I'm going to choose writing. Now I have a single line font. I'm going to adjust the lines here so I have two lines. So I'll put my cursor in front of joy and, and hit enter. And I also want to change the alignment to center it. So I go to alignment and hit center. Obviously, this is way too big for my card, so I'll go and change the size. I'll enter a width of four, and then I can adjust it from there. I'm going to place it where I want it on my card, and I'll make it just a little bit smaller. So the text and the score line and the card base need to be attached. So my text is already selected. So I'll scroll down, hold down the shift key, and select the score line. And then holding down the shift key again, select the square, which is my card base. Now click attach. I'm ready to cut. So I'll unhide my card front and I can move my card base to the back if I want to so I can see my card front again. So now I can click make it and it will preview my project on the mats and the, t the um, functions that it's going to do are going to be listed in order so it will score, do the writing, and cut. I'll click continue and it'll find my machine. I'll select the, my base material from my favorites. And it'll, it'll tell me what tools that I'll need to use and what order I'll need them. So it tells me to load the pin in clamp A, load the single scoring wheels because I'm using a maker in clamp B. And then after it completes those uh, uh, functions, it will pause and ask me for the premium fine point blade in clamp B. I hope this video has been helpful. If it has, please give me a like and consider subscri subscribing to my YouTube channel. Thanks for watching.